Hey, what's up, YouTubers? I just want to make a short video on how you can make money online, no matter where you live in the world. This is kind of aimed at people who are expats or people who want to earn on a part-time income, but earn it online without putting a lot of effort in. <laughs> Anyways, um, people are always asking me how I make a few bucks here and there. And one way is, is with Teespring. Now basically it's a t-shirt site where you design t-shirts and then you promote your t-shirt with a link. Then if they buy it, you get a certain amount of money above and beyond what the cost of the shirt are. Anyways, um, just go to Teespring, set up an account, and then uh, go from there. Anyways, they sell t-shirts and cups and things like that. So whatever you put on a t-shirt, you can put on a cup too. Anyways, um, basically it works like this if you're a creator. You design the product and they have their own um, platform you can do that on. You can also make your, your designs on other, uh, on other uh, software programs. There's a whole bunch of them out there. A lot of them are free, but you can basically look at what your parameters are and then create them there or you can create them right on their platform. And then you... Um, you promote it. You get a link to it and you promote it. Anyways, as you can see, there's a cup, there's a, a shirt, and I'll show you a little bit more. Um, the idea when you're doing this is is to do what you'd like or enjoy, like hobbies. This is a good example of that. If you click on hobbies, we'll, I'll show you what I mean. You'll notice a lot of these shirts are black with white uh, printing. That's about the most popular shirt, whether you're on Teespring, Sunfrog, Amazon, Merchandise. Uh, it's very popular and it sells really well, so I would suggest that. Here you can see they have a lot of different uh, shirts. You know, camping, that's a good one. You, get on, you, you find a camping shirt or you design a camping shirt. This is just an example. Then, like, I like cheap RV living. It shows this is a website that's devoted for people who like to live in RVs live in their vans, travel around the U.S., things like that. And presumably you, you've built up trust on, on the forums of places you want to promote your shirt because you don't want to go on a platform and just start spamming. And then uh, you just, you know, if you built up trust with people and you show them the shirt you designed and you, you put the link from uh, Teespring on there and they click on and buy it and you make a few bucks. It may not seem like a lot, but if you can tell 10, 20, 30 shirts in a month, it will add up. That's just an example. Also, if you design your shirt, you can go onto Facebook and uh, go onto various uh, groups like, here's an expat group I belong to, Guatemala Expats. You can go on there and if you've, if you've posted a lot of content and people trust you um, uh, and you design a shirt aimed at expats or expats who live in Guatemala, you know, they might click on and buy it. Anyways, um, back to Teespring. It's really not hard to set up an account if you have um, um, just you know you just design it and you know normally you just you have to have to have a PayPal account but a lot of times they'll send you a check which if you're an expat can be a pain in the neck but uh, generally speaking they have electronic ways they can pay you anyways you'll notice the popular shirts are black with with white lettering and here's another one um, I'm not sure this is the best design, but I'd rather have a bad day fishing than a good day at work. Um, and another thing is, there's politics here. Believe it or not, that's not really not a, a really high selling category. You want to stay away from politics and things like that. That might offend people, might not, but it depends on what your target group is. But generally speaking, people want like a black background with white print. And another thing, You'll notice some of these shirts aren't that complicated. It's just uh, font lettering and um, designs. I don't see one here right now, but um, you can get free designs. Google, you know, Google it and then download the free ones. They're just shapes and different sizes. You can mix and match and, and put them into a t-shirt, a really cool t-shirt design. And that works actually pretty well. I know people who do it. Um, then if you want to put some lettering in there, uh, you know, depending on what you want or what you think will sell, um, you can do that. Anyways, I just want to go over to Sunfrog real quick. It's the same thing. Just sign up for the free account. 
um, make your design and you get a percentage of the profits. Um, you can just see here the features. You can promote stuff, create your own designs. I think actually Sunfrog is actually a little better, but you know, put them up on a couple different sites, your designs, to see what happens. Anyways, um, let's go to. Um, I'm going to go to some of their t shirt designs. Hold on a second. Oh, here we go. Categories. Like, here's a good example outdoors. They have outdoors, fitness, automotive. It just depends. Um, lifestyle is another good one. Let's check out lifestyle. Again, you'll notice a lot of these shirts that they're selling are have a black background with white print. Keep calm and farm on. I've got your back. That's a pretty cool one. I saw that on Facebook. Um, again, you can promote these in Facebook groups or your own Facebook account. Pretty cool shirts. Anyways, you have basically the way it works. It costs 10 to 12 bucks for most of these to make the shirt. They make it, design it, and ship it. All you have to do is design the, uh, um, the print, and then you get a you you choose how much you want to sell your shirt for. So just an example, if it's twelve bucks and you sold it for a twenty, uh, you get eight dollars. This is really not bad. All these sites like Sunfrog and Teespring have a little bit different payout, but they're all basically the same. Now here's what I mean. Here's an example. See these are free designs you can download on Google. See there's a dryer, there's a lady's wig, there's a shaving knife of the old style, and then there's kind of those weird knives. Anyways you get the idea. You can just put those on there and design that. Uh, and people do buy them. And it's nothing really hard to do. It just takes 20 minutes to 30 minutes to learn how it works or learn your system of how to design these things. Anyways, as you can see, there's a lot on here. But it's just one way you can you make money. Now, if you just throw up a shirt, unless it's really popular or something catches on that you won't sell very many. So the idea here is you have to go on uh, Facebook, like your target group, like here, uh, I mean a lot of expat groups, making design shirts for expats that you think they might buy and just put them on here. And again, you don't want to spam your friends, but if you come up with some cool designs, people will buy them. Anyways, uh, like, share, subscribe, tell you what.